Hey guys, this is Emerald Fire, and this is just a short little video that I hope will help some people out that are in the same situation that I'm in. My computer uses an Intel graphics card, which as some of you know, is not supported by most versions of MCEdit. In fact, almost all versions of MCEdit crash when you try to use the brush or fill and replace or any features of MCEdit on an Intel graphics card. However, there is one version of MCEdit which just happens to be the one that I've had forever. It's the only one I've ever had and any time I tried to upgrade it would just crash so I would just switch back. And I just happened to have it. And Recently, I did upgrade, but I accidentally deleted my old version because I didn't know it would be a problem, and so I had to search all over the internet to find the same version that I had, because the one on GITHub.com was changed. I guess they re retroactively changed an old version, so it would no longer support Intel graphics cards. I don't know why, but anyway, I had to search all over the internet to try to find one that worked. And I just decided that I would post a link to uh, a zip file containing the version of MCEdit that I have. And I've uploaded it to Mediafire, and the link is in the description. Uh, see, you can do, you can use the brush, put some stone places, it works. Um, that's all. That's all, really. I just wanted to see uh, to uh, post this. Maybe help some people out. Anyone who's in the same situation as I am. So uh, I also included, just because I have them on my computer, uh, my fa a lot of filters by Seth Lane. So yeah, just filters. No, that's the wrong one. Um, filters, just have lots of self Seth Blings filters in here, just because, yeah. They were just on my computer when I made the zip file. So that's it. I hope I helped you out. And one last thing. When you extract the zip file, the MCEdit program will be called main.exe. If you want to, you can just make yourself a shortcut and rename it to MC Edit. Then you just click that. It opens this command prompt window. Wait a little bit. Some scrolling down. And there you have it. So, that's all for now. I'll see you next time.